Okay, this is the final liar, the one with the turtle shell. I am using this goat skin I purchased online. It's very sticky, which I don't know if it's because the pot was gross or what, but that's an interesting feature of this goat skin is how incredibly sticky it is. Okay, so I have changed up my materials. I'm using a much thicker needle and uh, cloth thread instead of fishing line and normal sewing needles. So hopefully this will make stuff a little easier than it has been in the past. Um, I'm going to do what I always do and sew it around to get the shape. And then I'm going to attempt to not use anything. Today I'm using super glue because it adheres better to bone, which turtle shell is, rather than um, hot glue, which does not. And now we begin. So I'm taking the thread and I'm pulling it through. All right, so I turned off the camera and didn't realize I'd done that. So that is interesting. Um, but at one point I said I was gonna eat my own hands, so I guess that was good that that didn't get in there, but then I said it again. Um, <laughs> the issue with doing any sort of project where you videotape yourself is you can do as many different takes as you like, but it's always yourself. Um, if you're prone to saying silly things, it doesn't always work out. Uh, it's important to realize I pulled, so I've been pulling the thread through, and now I have thread almost around the entire, um, I have thread around the entire snapping turtle shell, so a turtle, uh, tortoise shell, as would have been used in the Um, and I've surrounded it with thread, and I'm hoping that it contracts around the thread when it goes, but I'm also hoping I can use super glue to sort of anchor it in place, and then the thread can continue to hold it. Um, we'll see what happens. Now I'm using super glue and I'm just putting a little bit on the top of the shell and I'm going to press the goat skin to it and hope that that works. So I just used Gorilla Glue. Um, the reason I used Gorilla Glue is because it was what was in my name as cupboard. So, uh, because there was not an ancient equivalent to Gorilla Glue. Uh, or if there was, I have not discovered it. So, now we wait. Waiting for the super glue to dry on the turtle shell just did not work. So what I ended up doing was sewing the thread around it sort of crosswise to make it pull taut. And then to kind of clean it up and pretty it up, I took Gorilla Glue and strips of old t-shirt and sort of glued that all around the thread and the uh, goat skin at the sides to form a seal and then cut the thread off to make it look pretty. Um, yeah. So that's what I ended up doing. It's been a learning curve. I don't have a video of any of this process. Of course, that would be too prepared. But um, now my liar is complete. For more on this, please consult my blog. Thank you.